Town Hall event held Thursday in Tampa, Florida, quickly became a mob scene when citizens were forcibly kept out. Now, there were cameras there, but not everyone was happy about that. One photographer at the event had his camera knocked out of his hands as the event unraveled. Let's take a look. <laughs> The man who captured all of that on tape was on the receiving end of all of that was, and that scuffle was J. Mark Campbell. He's here with us now. Mark, thank you for being here. Wow, what a scene. Sean? Uh, kind of frightening. Yeah, <laughs> especially I, for me, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Why don't you give us a synopsis, then we're going to re-rack this tape, and you can give us a running commentary, okay. because I think people really need to understand what's happening sure. at these town halls, who's being shut out, who's who, who are the players here. Why don't you give us just a, a, an opening case of what was going on? All right, well, first of all, well, before the scene even happened, um, what it transpired was that it was already a stack deck before you even walked in the door. Meaning what stack deck? Well, they had already let in the uh, the people ahead of time and had filled up half the seats. Right. And there was a 200 seat event and, and half of them were already filled up. And so those people that got left just outside the door are the ones who just are the ones who would have made it if they hadn't been a stack now, deck. Now this is, this is Congresswoman Kathy Castor. Yes. Democrat? Yes. When you say stack deck, they wanted Democrats in there. She did not well, want a well, actually, real town hall. Well, actually, on the 40 Florida Security Council org website, you have a picture of them actually, a hidden photography thing of that actually happening. Right. And so. This is the one that said, I'm from Acorn, I'm from the Union, I'm from, or I'm from Acorn, let me in. Is that the tape you're talking about? No, no, no. This is a what? totally uh, a 15 second blurb where they actually have them saying, all right, we're going to line you up here in the front row, and then we're going to not let the other, we're, we're going we're gonna to put right. the other ones in the back. In other, gonna, in other words, we're going to ask you the question. So the whole thing oh, was yeah, set up. Yeah, it's yeah, like yeah. a Hollywood production. All right, let's yeah. re-rack this tape. Okay. And I want you to give a running commentary because you were there. You're the guy behind the camera. If we can roll this tape and then we'll talk as it's, it's rolling and you can explain. All right, here, what's happening here? Well, this those are people, well, that's the daughter of the, all right, first of all, the, 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 the it's the daughter of the cancer patient who she's trying, she's frantic because her dad has cancer. He's got a colostomy bag on right. his side and he's trying to, she's trying to get to him. Right. Who's in, who's already in the meeting. Right. The, yeah. No, no, no. He's on the outside. He's of the on door. the outside. So she wanted to get into the meeting and talk about her dad with a colostomy bag. Yeah. They were the, they, wow. they, they were the few that were ejected that let outside. They're right outside. And these four, four guys from the union here are the ones who... How do you know they're from a union? Well, got their business card. This, so, in other words, they gave you the business card. Yeah, the pipe fitters union. Okay, so and they were put, they were literally there as like security to yeah, stop. Yeah, they were the security to keep all the protesters out and in check. They didn't like what was going on outside, so they decided upon themselves to shut the doors. Now, what was happening was the guys were standing next to the doors there, so they just decided to bum rush these guys. So you're basically saying that these town halls, what you saw as a cameraman here, was a setup that all the Democrats got in first, and that. The regular, you know, average person that came th there to express their concern was shut out of this this meeting, so that there wouldn't be another embarrassing moment for another Democrat. That's right. That, that, it's a, it, pretty much. Yeah, pretty much in synopsis, and that they're that they're going. And the guy who he's actually a 28-year uh, Democrat, who they assaulted the right. guy with the guy with cancer. Now, in the end, was it? <clears throat> excuse me, my voice was shot. In the end, was there any any? Uh, opposition questions asked or you don't know because you didn't get it no I, I think well what happened to me was you know it's what you don't see in this video is what's really telling Sean is because after they after they attacked this cancer guy yeah. and they knew it after because she's screaming he's got cancer he's got cancer all right, right? they didn't what, what was the reaction were they sorry were they remorseful no right their reaction was to attack me because I was videotaping w it. were they trying to get your tape did, anyone, get, did yeah, anyone ask you for your tape? They slapped the camera around, as you can see, and then they grabbed the hold of it and they broke my glasses. Right. And uh, they shattered them. You know, I got them here. But oh, let me ask you a question, because um, you know I'm friends with all the cameramen here at Fox. They're all good friends of mine. And uh, how long have you been a cameraman? <laughs> well, it's 
you know, this is the, the, the worst thing that's ever happened to me as far, and I've been into, into, into right. jihadist areas, I've been right. dealing with, you know, Muslim extremists, and, you know, I've, this is the most afraid I've ever been. So in other words, is we have a, a, literally these manufactured town halls, they're stacking the deck because they're afraid the American people may go in and ask some tough questions. So the very thing they're accusing the Republicans of doing, they themselves are doing, and you saw it with your own eyes. Yeah, yeah. and what's the, the irony about it was, it was Union Democrats attacking another Union member, and and that's I'm, you. And, I, and I'm also, I was also a former Teamster at one time, so. Yeah. Uh, and well, they, was there any evidence of acorn there? I, I, can't, I, can't, I can't honestly say. How was that woman with her father, the, girl, the woman whose father had cancer? Did she do okay? I mean, she seemed like she was roughed up a little bit. I have not been able to talk to her since the event, so I really don't know. All right. I'm trying to be honest with you. So. Thank you for sharing that with us. We well, really thank you, appreciate, John. I appreciate it. it. I appreciate have it. Have a good day.